Okay, so I just tried a LUT pack from one of my favorite YouTube creators. And seriously, pretty blown away right now. Check this out. See? LUTs. Now let me know in the comments if you can figure out which creator I got these from. And get ready, because here's your hint. What's, What's up, up, everybody? Vaughn Myra here. Hope you're having a great day. In this video, we're gonna go over how to bring in and use custom LUTs in Movavi Video Editor. So without wasting any time, let's go. To begin, we should talk about what a LUT is. And since YouTube already has so much great content explaining this, I'll skip the long explanation and shorten it up into one sentence. LUT is just an acronym for lookup table. And a lookup table is a tool used to save particular color grades as templates to conveniently reuse time and time again. Now you can find LUTs and LUT packs all over the internet. Some free, some through subscription services, and others that you can buy outright for a set price. Wherever you decide to pick up your LUTs, just be sure that they're in a dot cube format. It's pretty common, but just double check before you actually pay, because oftentimes these kind of things are non-refundable. Whether you purchase LUTs or get them for free, you'll need to download a LUT file. After downloading the LUT file, it will look something like this. Or if you download a pack of LUTs, the file may look something like this. Once you've got your LUT file, you'll need to import it into your video editor. This part is pretty simple. However, there are a few things you really should know about. So we're gonna go over these things, but before we do, I just wanna mention that if you're feeling uncomfortable downloading LUTs from third parties, or the format stuff seems a bit too complicated, Trust me, I totally get that. And I have good news. You can avoid all the stress by downloading your LUTs directly from Movavi's effects store. So if you like that idea, I'll leave a link in the description that'll take you directly to Movavi's LUT packs. I'll also leave a discount code that you can use to save a little on your purchase. All that and more will be down in the description, so be sure to check that out. Okay, back to importing. Let's jump into the editor. Here we are in Movavi Video Editor. And for this example, I placed a short video clip down in the timeline. So with this video clip highlighted, we'll want to head over to the More Tools icon and select Color Adjustments. Next, we'll want to click this LUTs tab up here. Now, if you get to this step and you don't see this LUTs tab, keep watching because I'll definitely be going over how to get it. Okay, so after opening the LUTs tab, we'll see this gallery. And if you notice, there's a little plus icon right here in the top right corner. To import a LUT, let's give that a click. Now as you can see, Movavi has instantly opened up my files and is now basically saying, hey, choose a LUT you want to import. Right here on my desktop is where I save all of my new LUTs. So now I can simply choose which one I want and it will instantly be imported into my LUT gallery. Now one final note here, and this is really important. Currently you can only import one LUT at a time. So if you download a pack of LUTs and it came in a compressed folder like this, Take a moment and decompress or extract the files. I wanted to mention this because when I purchased my LUT pack, it came in a zipped file, and when I first tried to import it into Movavi, I couldn't find it. This folder and the files within it wouldn't even appear as an option. Okay, so quick recap. You can import as many LUTs as you want, but you can only import one at a time. Be sure to remember that the LUT file needs to be a .cube format. And now that we know how to import LUTs, let's jump back into the gallery and talk about how to use them. To apply one of these LUTs, all we need to do is grab one like this and drop it on whatever clip we prefer. If you have a whole bunch of clips and you'd like to apply the same LUT to all of them, you can easily do this by highlighting all the clips at once like this, go up to the LUT you want to use, right click, and choose the option that says apply to selected clips. Okay, so now that you know how to import and apply the LUTs that you want, that's a great starting point. But it's likely that you'll need to make a few extra color adjustments to bring out that perfect look, which is why I made this video right here that specifically goes over how to use Movavi's color adjustments. So please check that out. And remember, importing LUTs is a new feature in Movavi Video Editor 2022. So if that seems like something you need, you can pick up the 2022 version with a discount by using the coupon code in the link in the description. Thanks for watching.